God our Father and Jesus Christ our Lord will see us through everything and are always with us. God our Father is our strength, our might, and our power, and all we have comes from Him. Rely on Him always. He knows what's best for us. Look to God our Father, brethren, for His grace and love overwhelms us all in Jesus Christ our Lord. 2 Thessalonians 3.3 3. Yet faithful is the Lord who will be establishing you and guarding you from the wicked one. Ephesians 6, 10 through 12. For the rest, brethren mine, be invigorated in the Lord and in the might of his strength. Put on the panoply of God to enable you to stand up to the stratagems of the adversary. For it is not ours to wrestle with blood and flesh, but with the sovereignties, with the authorities, with the world mights of this darkness, with the spiritual forces of wickedness, wickedness among the celestials. Ephesians 3, 20. Now to him who is able to super excessively above all that we are requesting or apprehending according to the power that is operating in us. Philippians 3.10, to know him and the power of his resurrection and the fellowship of his sufferings, conforming to his death. Colossians 1.11, being endured with all power in accord with the might of his glory for all endurance and patience with joy. Colossians 1.29, For which I am toiling also, struggling in accord with this operation, which is operating in me with power. 1 Thessalonians 1.5, For the evangel of our God did not come to you in word only, but in power also, and in Holy Spirit, and much assurance, according you are aware, such we became among you because of you. 2 Timothy 1.7, For God gives us not a spirit of Timidity. But of power and of love and of sanity. 1 Corinthians 1.18 For the word of the cross is stupidity indeed to those who are perishing, yet to us who are being saved, it is the power of God. 1 Corinthians 1.30-31 Yet you of him are in Christ Jesus who became to us Wisdom from God, besides righteousness and holiness and deliverance, that according as it is written, he who is boasting in the Lord, let him be boasting. Love, grace, and peace to you all. Have a wonderful day and wonderful night, and God bless each and every one of you.